Welcome to a day in the life of Erling Holland. Let's start off with his new luxury condo he just purchased. Erling reportedly made a full circle return to Norway with the purchase of a 3.28 million apartment in Oslo. It's located in the Petter Stordalen owned hotel Sommerero on Sully Plus in Oslo, one of Oslo's most affluent districts. And since he's making 1 million euros every week, this pricey apartment shouldn't set him back too much. He also makes sure to leave his house in style every day. He was even spotted attending the Dolce & Cabana runway show in Italy this past July, sporting a powder blue double-breasted Dolce & Gabbana blazer. He also doesn't mind wearing some more exotic outfits from time to time. At one point, he even sat down with GQ to do a photo shoot. But nothing is more impressive than his watch collection. The first watch he ever purchased was the Rolex Submariner Kermit. This goes for $19,000. But that's nothing compared to his latest watch, the Audemars Piguet Royal Oak. This set him back $350,000. And not only that, he has quite a selection of watches, including a Rolex Submariner Hulk, a Rolex Smurf, a Rolex GMT Master II root beer, a Rolex Daytona and Daytona Platinum, a Paytech Philip Nautilus, a Rolex Daytona Eye of the Tiger, and a Royal Oak Perpetual Calendar. Now that's a lot of watches, and his entire collection set him back $1,466,000. He's also a bit of a sneakerhead himself, but his favorite pair is definitely the Louis Vuitton Nike Air Force Ones by Virgil Abloh. These go for about $20,000. Though, he usually walks around in his Nike Air Max 95's Dusk Edition, which only costs about $424. Though, fashion doesn't mean much if you don't have a nice car to show up in. Luckily for Holland, he has a couple. On his days off, he usually drives around in his Rolls-Royce Cullinan, which goes for 355,000 euros. And for practice and team meetings, he used to show up in his Mercedes AMG GLE Coupe or his Audi RS6. Now that we know how he gets to work, let's now shift our focus to how he fuels his body and maintains peak performance on the pitch. And trust me, his daily routine is like nothing you've ever seen. It starts in the morning when the Champions League anthem wakes him up as his alarm clock. Then he told us, the first thing I do in the morning is get some sunlight in my eyes. It's good for the circadian rhythm. His diet consists of beef heart and liver, as well as specially filtered water. Though, his dad will occasionally make his favorite dish, lasagna. Even The Rock had a hard time believing it. So he eats hearts and liver yep. and lasagna before every game. Yep, yep, yep. He's in amazing shape. His dad later confirmed that Erling follows Cristiano Ronaldo's diet and consumes 6,000 calories every day. Now it makes sense how he went from looking like this to this. In his house, he installed a 50,000 pound cryo chamber to help his body recover. He also does ice baths, yoga, and meditation. And before he goes to sleep, he wears blue light glasses, disconnects the Wi-Fi, and tapes his mouth shut. I think sleep is the most important thing in the world. Blue blocking glasses, shutting out all the signals and everything. That's, that's and you should try to tape your mouth then. At night. <laughs> no, yeah, now, why right not? Now. Or when you train. <laughs> oh. And we should also mention, he has five hat trick balls and he sleeps with each one of them. And when he's not working, he's playing video games, specifically Minecraft with the boys. He also enjoys shopping. And when he's in the USA, that's not much of a problem. But back in the UK, he has doctors and security watching over him 24 hours a day. But you don't need security when you're out on the seas. Erling occasionally hangs out on yachts and has been spotted with Tommy Hilfiger. Another time, he was spotted on a yacht in Mykonos. He was sporting the Louis Vuitton watercolor outfit, which altogether costs a whopping 2,250 pounds. Holland is dating fellow footballer Isabel Johansson. Johansson is a footballer who currently plays for the women's senior team of the Norwegian team Bruna Football Club. They met back in Bruna and began dating during his time at Dortmund. They liked the vacation in Spain and were spotted dining at the Ivy restaurant in Manchester. She has consistently traveled to Manchester to watch her boyfriend's games in the Premier League. He often spends time with his father, Alpha Inga Holland, talking about football and the ways to improve his game. His dad previously played for Manchester City. He also spends a good amount of time with his younger sister, Gabrielle, and his older brother, Astor. 